Wow, the Alpine A521, it looks amazing. And it's so exciting to have the Alpine name on a Formula One car. Esteban, how do you feel the team is looking for 2021? Well, I've exchanged with, uh, with the technical team. So I had my engineers on the phone uh, throughout winter and, and the mechanics and, and what I see is, is very encouraging. Um, I think we're in good shape. The car is an evolution of 2020, which is positive for us. Um, the team is expected to get into Q3. Uh, we had good rhythm, plus I got that podium feeling, um, which I loved, obviously. And uh, yeah, I'm very keen to, to get that back. Um, on the other side, we had great results uh, also. Um, but what we want is to get them on a regular basis now. Behind the wheel of this gorgeous A521, we have a new driver lineup that I would like to say a few words about. First, Fernando Alonso. He has come home 20 years after he made his debut with us. He is back with honors as a two-time world champion and an international star. He brings us his speed, his tenaciousness, his will, his talent, his experience, and his commitment. It is a great pride to have this fantastic driver, but it's also a big responsibility. Esteban Ocon is a star in the making. He has given us our best results with his second place in Bahrain. He brings his talent in full ascent as well as his fighting spirit and cool head, his humility and consistency. We can expect some beautiful podium finishes from him. This is a magnificent duo. They embody the values of the Group Renault and the authenticity of Alpine. They have earned their place among the elite of motorsports uh, out of their sheer talent. We are in Formula One for the long run, and we are here to win. We will put all required means to be at best competitive level. Allez les bleus.